Have you ever wondered if we could turn back the clock on aging? For centuries, humans have dreamed of eternal youth, but it's always been the stuff of fantasy. Well, what if I told you that science is getting closer than ever to making that dream a reality? Welcome to the cutting edge of aging research, where scientists are not just trying to slow down the clock, but actually reverse it. So, why do we age in the first place? It's not just about wrinkles and gray hair. At a cellular level, our bodies are in a constant battle. Our DNA accumulates damage. The protective caps on our chromosomes called telomeres get shorter, and old, dysfunctional cells, known as senescent cells, start to build up. Think of it like a car. Over time, parts wear out, rust develops, and performance drops. Our bodies are incredibly complex machines, and after decades of running, they start to show signs of wear and tear. But here's where it gets exciting. Scientists are now identifying the key drivers of aging, what they call the hallmarks of aging. By understanding these processes, they can develop targeted interventions. For example, some studies are exploring ways to clear out those pesky senescent cells. Imagine a cleanup crew coming into your body and removing all the cellular junk, allowing healthy cells to thrive. This has shown incredible results in animal studies, extending not just lifespan, but health span, the number of years lived in good health. One of the most groundbreaking areas is epigenetic reprogramming. Our DNA is like a massive library of instructions, but epigenetics is the librarian that decides which books are read. As we age, the librarian gets a bit disorganized. Researchers have discovered that they can reprogram cells, essentially reminding them how to be young and functional again. In one jaw-dropping experiment, scientists were able to restore vision in old mice by resetting their epigenetic clock. So, can we really reverse aging? The honest answer is, we're not there yet for humans, but the breakthroughs are happening at an incredible pace. We're moving from a world where we just treat age-related diseases to one where we might be able to prevent them by targeting aging itself. This isn't about living forever. It's about living healthier, more vibrant lives for longer. The future of aging is being rewritten right now, and it looks younger than ever. What do you think about these advancements? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more amazing science.